All right, so welcome back once again. If you are somebody new to my channel, my name is Niklesh and I live here in Berlin. Today, we will be focusing on masters in chemistry here in Germany in public universities. If you are somebody who is currently studying your bachelor's in any type of chemistry bachelor's, this video is for you. Through this video, you will learn about there is an Excel sheet which my company, which is Nikshala, has made. In this Excel sheet, you will see that there are a set of universities with specific filters attached to it. That means something which would have taken hours and hours of yours now can be done within few click of a button. And then the only thing what will be left next is to apply directly for the universities. In this list, you could apply in any type of chemistry masters. For example, if you're interested in organic, inorganic, whether it be physical chemistry, analytical chemistry, biochemistry, all these courses are widely available here in Germany. So without talking much, let me just take you to my screen and show you. So what you see behind me is the nickshala.com website. All right, so once you're on nickshala.com, what you have to do is to get that Excel sheet for chemistry. Scroll all the way at the bottom. There is a folder which says courses shortlisting. And sometime we're gonna change the names, but it's gonna be here at the bottom. So go into this bottom card, uh, scroll all the way at the bottom again. Now, since chemistry is part of natural sciences, so, uh, we might create another folder by the name of natural sciences. As of now, we have kept the chemistry file, the folder inside here under engineering. So when you come here, uh, go and click here, chemistry. And the moment you are inside it, uh, since it's a paid service, so do the payment. And then I will now show you what does the Excel sheet looks like after you've done the payment. And uh, just to give you a heads up, in case for future, if you're watching this, uh, if the chemistry folder is not in the engineering, it will be uh, in a separate natural sciences folder. So do check that folder as well, in case if you don't find it here under engineering. So here we are, uh, this is the Excel sheet, what you will get once you are done with the payment. Um, here you can find universities. Now the beauty of this Excel sheet is in their filters. So if you look here, uh, let's say if you want to study in only metro cities, like for example, I will deselect. I only want to study in Berlin. I only want to study in Dresden. I only want to study in Erlangen. Um, I only want to study in Munich, Mainz, Köln. So the moment you keep selecting, uh, you will start seeing that all the big city universities are right here in front of your eyes with the click of a button. Um, again, if that's your choice if you want that beside location uh there is courses as well uh again there are filters right here beside this what language the course is in how many semesters the cor course is going to be when is it starting now i know that a lot of students when they graduate by then already summer intake is about to come or winter is about to start so you can deselect and only select the winter intake winter intake is the biggest intake uh here in germany when does the application start? Now, this is something which you would not find it on any of the search engines available outside to look for universities in Germany. Um, because we have dealt with so many students for so many years, we were able to collect the data. And uh, you can put the start date when you want to, uh, you know, when you want to get started. And then you can check within those parameters what you have put, what, which ones are available. So this is how it is. Um, when is a deadline is already mentioned here. If it requires tuition fees or not, since we're dealing with public university, there is no tuition fees. Semester contribution is mentioned. How much IELTS is required is mentioned. Let's go further from here on. Uh, if you're giving TOEFL, then there's a requirement here. If you need German language or not, uh, again, you can see clearly that there are courses which needs German language um, right here. So what you can do is just to filter, quickly go into this deselect go down there's something called as not required these are the courses which don't need any german language for example right so let me just deselect and move ahead from here on whether you need to give gre gmat or not do you need to have work experience or not like for example required uh not required if the university page would have mentioned it we would have definitely written, written how much but they just wrote required um this section is very very crucial because uh, this is going to save ton of your time and money. Um, so as you know, and even if you don't know, 
Uniassist usually charges money, which is like 75 euro and then 30, 30 euro every time you file an application through them. So what we do is uh, because university portal directly, they do not charge any money. I asked my team to let's create this filter and this is what we did and then deselect only university portal. So these are the places where you can apply. And at times I've seen mostly that you do not have to pay any sort of uh, application fees when you apply directly to public university, university portal. Anyway, having said that, I will go ahead and uh, you can see university portal or uni assist or VPD plus university portal. Um, next to that, there is a website link. These are the links which will take you directly to this particular course. What documents are required is also mentioned right here. Uh, you can check that as well. Beside this, there is something called as what bachelors are accepted for this particular program, what you've selected. That's also mentioned right here. Again, you can go into filters and filter out whatever your bachelors is and then see if the if your current degree is accepted here or not. Lastly, again, a very, very crucial part, which is how much German GP is required to enter that particular course. If they have mentioned, if the university have mentioned that, hey, we need this and this grades, then only you apply. You can clearly see people need 2.5, 2.9, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5. So if your grades are into CGPA or percentage, you can go to nikshala.com, go to German grade calculator, and this is where you can convert your CGPA or a percentage into German GPA, okay? And then see uh, if you fall in the category or not. If you don't, then don't apply. I mean, you, you'll end up wasting your time and, and money. But if you do, then of course, go ahead and apply into those universities. So yeah, this is what uh, I have when it comes to Excel sheet and universities for masters in chemistry in different uh, departments of chemistry. If you need any help when it comes to uh, samples for SOP, letter of recommendation, uh, CV, if you want to learn German language, uh, we have everything right here on this website. So do scroll through and see what is best for you. Uh, what I'll do is I will also leave this uh, link for the Excel sheet, the first link in the description. Uh, make sure that you check that out. If you've made it till here, thank you so much for joining. Uh, hit that thumbs up button and I'll see you guys next time.